dog treats to hot lunch. A reminder, those were granola bars. Those were not dog treats. Dog treats may only be served to Animal Farm staff. Thank you. Somebody's on the phone! <laughs> Holding on the line, Dirk the Fools and Forgotten Shipmunk speaking. How may I help you? You're be in your own movie. Do I want to be in my own movie? Yeah. Oh yes, very much. Yes, very much. I do. I do. I'm not, I'm not even gonna. Yeah, yeah, totally. Yeah, so definitely. So much. So really, a lot, a whole lot. What will you call your movie? I will call my movie Dirk's movie. That's what I will call it. I will, oh, no, you know what? No, no, you know what? I'm going to call it Dirk 3, Revenge of the Chipmunk. How about that? See, I'm going to... That is so funny. I'm going to start with a three. I'm going to just jump out of the gate. I'm going to start with number three. So people think they've missed something. Yeah. Okay. Yeah? So that's kind of weird. It is a bit weird. It's a bit old. I'll give you that. When is it coming out? I, I don't know. I'm not in charge of distribution. I just, I, I'm just the idea guy. Yeah, Christmas. Christmas. All right, that, you know, you can't go wrong with a Christmas release. That's all right. Yeah. So who should I get to be in the film with me? Uh, who should be my co-star? Uh, I don't know. I don't know. Me. Me. You. All right, you. Yes, you. What's your name? Colin. Colin, all right, Colin. So you could be like, like, this Christmas, the world will be saved by Colin and Dirk in Dirk 3, Revenge of the Chipmunk, also starring Dwayne The Rock Johnson. <laughs> How was that? Was that good? Yeah. And what did happen in the... What did happen in your movie? Oh, you mean like a story? Yeah. Well, first of all, I think the chipmunk should dominate the entire world. I think the chipmunk should have all-encompassing power over the entire world. And then, through no fault yeah. of his own, some some less loved and unpopular chipmunks uh, get very jealous of him, and they try to take his power away uh, by using an evil llama robot that no one can touch. And the llama robot comes up and then accidentally kidnaps Dirk. But Dirk manages to escape just in time as Colin swoops in on a giant starship. A lot like, yeah, it's a bit like the Millennium Falcon that Han Solo flies, only it's much cooler. Anyway, so Colin flies in and blows up the evil robot and they all live happily ever after. <laughs> that was good, Dirk. Yeah, you know, yeah, see, I think so, too. I think, it, I mean, it just, I don't know where these ideas come from, really. They just kind of just pop out of my head. I mean, it's just one of those but things. But you'll be, um, um, your movie for it, it to be two. Like, two. Oh, uh, you mean, you want to know what the sequel is? What? You mean the Dirk 2? Yeah. I haven't really worked that out. That's that's a prequel. So I haven't gotten to the prequel yet, but I'll work on that. I haven't figured that out. It's Revenge of the Chipmunk and then... Oh, I know it. What? I know the next one. What's the next one? Dirt versus Llama. Oh, Chipmunk versus Llama. Oh, I like that. CVL. Yeah. No, and then... And... and um, that's good. That's good. And you have a lightsaber. And I have a lightsaber, exactly. And a llama has nothing. Me too. He spits, and I swing the lightsaber. You, 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 you know, that kind of a thing. Sir? Yes. We're running out of batteries. All right, well, that's all right. This has been very helpful. I'm no, sorry. No, have to go. Yes, I've got to run, too. I'm, I'm very busy. I've got to go. But, well, like... I'll talk to you later. All right, we'll talk again soon, Bye. all right? Ta-ta! Bye, Colin! Bye. Bye. Yeah, D3. Yeah, that's right. And then Chipmunk versus Llama. I'm not sure how it ends yet, but it's important that everyone know that I wind up married to Selena Gomez, I think. 
Yeah. Hear the Animal Farm with Kenny Curtis today at 3 p.m. East or noon West on Kids Place Live, Sirius XM Channel 78.